Hey guys, and this is the Mage 715 update. This is going to be a, a little bit different of a uh, Tell Me When preview, um, as the mages themselves, um, I've been playing with them and tinkering with them, I've been watching the rotations and asking a lot of people. Um, Rotation-wise, they haven't changed in a huge way. A lot of the changes that took place were changes to the legendaries that they had, changes to the talents, whether they've been made baseline or removed completely or swapped around the trees. Um, so all of that has been addressed here. And um, they also have the addition of the mage armor, which will be an icon represented in the bottom right of all three of the profiles. Um, that said, I figured a better time uh, what use of the time I have if, you, if you're paying attention is to just talk about how to use a profile like this and also other profiles like this uh, to get the most out of your class. And the best way to summarize it is basically to say you can use these profiles as a starting guide. A way for you to step into a class that you've never played before or maybe you've been playing it for a long while but you haven't really been getting the most out of it. Um, that's what they're for. These are not meant to really be replacements for player skill, and that's never been the intention. The, the idea behind each of these profiles is to make it so that you could easily swap into the role and just sit there and enjoy playing the class um, at at least 90% efficiency. That last 10% unfortunately comes from player skill, and that's something that each person will have to spend their own time to get used to and just get just to get a better understanding of each class that they play. Um, some people can do it much quicker than others, but what I recommend is to use the links I have in the description below that take you to the Icy Veins and also ask your friends and ask people on MMO Champion um, just exactly any tips that they can give you on how to play classes like Mage. Um, and then once you have that information, you should be able to come in and see this profile and see get a better understanding of why certain spells show up when they do. Um, that said, uh, you can go into this blind and just follow what it says in the center of the screen. And it, as I said, it will give you at the bare minimum 90% of your maximum DPS potential. Um, but cooldown usage, using your rune of power, using or encanter's flow, whatever other abilities you have, along with trinket usage, um, just movement and fight mechanics, all of those are factors into how you can perf perform better as a player, no matter what class you are. Um, so. Yeah, as always, you can find this profile on chester.weebly.com. Uh, you can also find links on Rebrandly. I will update it uh, if you have that bookmarked. And um, yeah, like I said, just take the moment, do some reading, get a better understanding of the class. You'll enjoy the game 100% more once you know what you're, what you're actually pressing and why. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like what you see, and I will catch you in the next video.